Hello everyone, thank you for joining my tutorials. Today we'll see how we can able to use this coordinate conversion tool. Using this tool, we can able to convert latitude from decrement second into degree decimal or decrement second into UTM. So whatever the format you want, you can able to convert and you can able to check the latitude and longitude. So how to use this tool that we'll see, okay? Like suppose here I will insert a new map. So let I will copy this shape file and I will paste it here. So what we need to do here, okay, we need to go to maps, then coordinate conversion. Okay. So like this, I will all select and I will delete from here so now if you'll see here this is my shape file and i'm interested to know some locations within the shape file and if you right click go to properties in the source in the special reference we can able to see this is in wgs 1984 okay world geodetic system and now if i'll move my cursor here you can able to see the lat long is changing here Okay, so first, if I'll click here at this options, you will see here these options. That is a edit properties. You can able to choose what latitude longitude you want to see. Okay, here. So like if you want to see decimal degree or degree minute second that you can able to select or UTM. Okay, so like I'll select degree minute second here. Okay, you can able to see it is showing the degree minute and seconds. And after that, you can able to take this map point tool. Just click on the map point tool and you will able to see this converted into plus icon. Okay. If this way is there, it is a pan is showing. But when you will click here, it will convert into plus icon. Like suppose you want to know the lat long here. Okay. You just left click and then you can able to add locations here. Okay. So what are the locations you want? You just left click there. You can able to add point at that location. Okay. So now you can able to see what are the location we have added here. We can able to see the latitude and longitude. So this is in degree minute second. Now you want to convert it into UTM. Just select and just click on OK. So now it is converted into UTM zone. So this is UTM zone 43. Then north and easting you can able to see. After that, if you want to see the decimal degree, just click OK. Now this location will change into decimal degree. So this way very easily we can able to get the latitude and longitude and we can able to convert it into desired format. So if you want to save this or you want to change the symbology, that also you can able to do. If you click here, then you can able to change the symbology from here. Just click on the symbology. And like you want to show by this point, you can take this and just click on apply. So it will change. So now if you want to export this, okay, if you want to export this latitude and longitude to desired locations. So what you can able to do, you just click on the export option is there. Okay. Just click on the export and you want to export it as shape file, KMZ file, CSV file that you can able to select. Like if you want to open it in Google Earth Pro, you can select as a KMZ. Just click on OK. Now you need to choose a folder where you want to save this file. Okay. So let I will go to desired locations. So I'm working here. I will save here as a KML. And I will add here as a lat long DD. So I'm saving this in decimal degree. So I'll add DD and just click on the save. So this way very easily we can able to save the latitude and longitude and now you can able to open that in Google Earth Pro. So how to open it that also we'll see. Okay. So let I will open here my Google Earth Pro. Just click on the file open. So I have saved my file here in KML folder and this is the lat long DD. Just click on open.
Now you can able to see all the latitude longitude which we have taken there is added here. Okay. So this way very easily we can able to get the latitude longitude and we can able to add in different softwares as well. So if you are having any doubts regarding all this, you can ask me in the comment sections. If you like this video, don't forget to like, share and subscribe to my channel. Thank you.